Well, hello, my friend, and welcome to my channel. Today, I've got Moonshine Manny's Celebrate Everything, and I'm going to stamp on it. I've started off with Meltix Formula 2 and Moonshine Manny's Celebrate Everything. And then I topped it off with some Pro FX Quick Dry Top Coat. I'll be stamping with Clean Color Metallic Fuchsia today. It's not a stamping polish, but it works great. And Westonia W217. My Bundle Monster Monocle Stamper and my Faber Nail Scraper. And I'm just going to put this image on all my nails and on all of them except for one. I'm going to face them all the same direction and then I'm going to flip it for my accent nail. Very kind of, uh, you know, kind of a discreet mani. Not, not too much bling, not too much in your face. Just something a little more subtle. Wanted to make sure to be able to leave. Um, plenty of room for that uh, celebrate everything to shine a little bit. It's a beautiful polish. I enjoyed wearing it for a couple of days before I decided to stamp on it. And like I said, these clean color polishes are not stamping polishes, but I love these metallics for stamping. They just normally do such a good job and they're really easy to clean up. And these are supposed to be like tentacles to an uh, um, octopus, but, you know, without, you know, seeing them, you know, with other stuff, it just, it just looks like something kind of like a fancy design, you know, so I just went with it. There we go, cleaning that plate off with some acetone. We're going to do one more. We'll do that pink and nail. Good thing I have a mat underneath me because I am making a mess. There we go. I'm going to clean up what I can with some tape. Just kind of peel off that excess dried polish from around my fingertips. This doesn't always work, but I'm always so happy when it does. And then I'm going to just do a little bit more cleaning up with a little touch of acetone and a cleanup brush. And I'm sorry I'm out of frame almost completely out of frame, but we're, you know, we're working on it. I'm going to use this Bundle Monster Smudge Free Top Coat first before I apply my regular top coat. So far, I've been really impressed with it. It has not smeared anything, no matter how long I wait for it to dry. If it's just a few seconds or minutes, it seems to be doing the trick. I'm going to use this Pro FX Quick Dry Top Coat over that Smudge Free Top Coat. And then we're going to call this one, ta-da, some purple on purple. I'm liking it. I do have a swatch photo coming up here in just a moment. So, but I would love to hear what you think about this one. Um, you know, leave me a comment down below and let me know. So here's that swatch photo I was talking about. And that is it for today. Thanks for watching. And until next time, be good to yourself. Talk to you soon.